Hello, I am Fobo001, and today I'm going to teach you... HOW TO ORGANIZE YOUR ions. Cutting right to the chase, whatever that's actually supposed to mean. Method 1. Delete add-ons you do not use anymore. If you have any add-ons that you do not use anymore, like for example, if you have like a couple of weapons or a map or something that you don't play on or don't use, then you should probably delete it from your add-ons. Like, soon. Because, you know, you don't want to clog up all of those things and all the things you don't use anymore. It's like, no, oh, I can't find out what I want to use. This is so irritating. I hate this. Oh, I'm going to stop playing. Oh. If you're not sure if you have something you want to use or not, you should probably try it out a couple of times, see what you can do with it. And if you don't like it, you can delete it. If you do like it, you can keep it. Yeah. It's that easy. Method 2. Use a third-party add-on manager. Uh, wait a minute. Wait. Something's wrong here. Where is... Technical difficulties for a second. Hold on. I must have totally f missed something because everything's gone. There is no add-on manager anymore. So, okay, I'm going to have to find a 2.5 for this method. Just give me a minute here. Method 2.5. Use subversions to stay updated. Using subversions, or SVNs, you can keep your add-ons updated with the absolute latest versions that released versions will not have. That's because SVNs are awesome. I personally use Tordos SVN, but if you are really want to try something else, you can. There's a whole bunch of different SVN programs, but I use Tordos because um, it's the easiest and most user-friendly. And it's just overall has this cool SVN checkout thing. You should try it really quick. Method 3. Merge the add-on files with your main install of Gary's Mod. Caution, this might mess up some of your files. Like if it's their skins or something in the add-on. You will see what I mean in a second. If you're like me and you hate WireMod SVN because when you update your WireMod and put it in your add-ons, it just gets all funky with Gary's Mod because it takes like five minutes to load up, which is ridiculous. Uh, I haven't tested this yet, so I should probably go test it now really quick. Now let's look in the wire menu, and uh, let's try the CD disk. And look at that! You see the model? Oh, hey look! The model's there! Hooray, it worked! Anyways, back to describing. Merging files could sometimes mess up your installation sometimes, but doing it, however, will prevent Gary's Mod from having to load up all of your add-ons, which actually takes a strain on Gary's Mod by performance and load times. So, the more add-ons you have, the longer load times you're going to have and the lower performance you're going to have overall. So, yeah, and you just try to keep the add-ons at a little minimum there, alright, buddy? Well, that about sums up the things you can do to optimize your add-ons, or organize them, in this case, or other cases. Um, uh, <laughs> other cases. Anyways, that's not going to be a blooper. By the way, there's going to be a little blooper thing at the end of the video here. So, uh, anyways, thank you for watching this video, and I hope you, um, uh, learned some of the many ways you can optimize your add-ons. That's only a few off, I know, off the, um, uh, top of my head, and, uh, a lot of thought, but, you know. I hope you can find some use out of this video. So then you didn't waste your time. Bye bye. <laughs> oh my god, my throat. That hurts. Ow. <clears throat> okay. Anyways, bye. Method two. Ugh. God. Ah. Method two. Use an add-on manager. Fuck. Wait a minute. Ugh. Forget the bat one part. Damn it. Using subversions or SVNs, you can stay or keep your. Oh, darn it. Me in my random stammering and improvised talks. Or talking. Yeah, and I'm just gonna go bleed now. Dude. Method 2. Use a third party add on. Oh. Using subversions or just SVN, you can stay or keep your. Um, fuck, damn it. Using subversions or SVNs, you can. <sighs> well, that about sums up the ways you can um, use, you know. Ah, fuck it.